7 at 4.30, a violent weekend in New Haven and Hamden as gunfire sends seven people to the hospital. Sunday afternoon in New Haven, two people were shot right in the middle of the day after roughly 30 rounds were fired in the area of Shelton and Ivy. That followed two separate shootings early Saturday morning and late Friday night in neighboring Hamden where three people were hit by bullets after gunfire erupted following a vigil for a teenager who was shot and killed three years ago. Fortunately, none of the injuries are life-threatening, but New Haven Evans mayor says all of this is concerning. As you can imagine, it's pretty frustrating because we're putting, we're doing everything we know possibly to, to help support young people, but also make sure that there's accountability. And Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarland is live in New Haven right now. And Matt, as police investigate this, what is the thought about this recent uptick? Well, you heard the mayor right there. He says police are investigating, but the thought is it could be related to some previous beasts, possibly looking into potential retaliation. As you mentioned, one of the shootings followed that vigil in Hamden. That was for a 14-year-old who was killed in New Haven three years ago. So they're thinking that might be some sort of type of retaliation. Also, another one of the shootings in New Haven actually happened in the same area where that teenager was killed three years earlier. So again, plenty of things that police are looking into. Mayor says they have their intel meeting. Uh, every Monday looking to see who could possibly be involved, what detectives know. Also, he says using the cameras set up throughout the city, that's aiding in the investigation as well. And he also mentions they use uh, street outreach workers trying to stem the violence before it stops, uh, getting in contact, talking with those who uh, have engaged in violence in the past, might be uh, inclined to pick up a gun or be involved in gun violence. So that's something that they're working on as well. And Matt, you know, a lot can be told from where we go year to year in terms of shootings. How about the numbers right now? Where do we stand? Well, Stephanie, the mayor says right now it's sort of a mixed bag. He says uh, there's good and there's bad. The good is that the number of homicides uh, this time this year is down from this time last year. 17 last year at this point, 8 this year. He says that's good. Uh, also, total number of shots fired. He says that number is down as well. He says, unfortunately, the number of people shot, that's up comparative to this time last year. So he says numbers are trending in the right direction. He says, but still plenty of work to to be done. All right, Matt McFarland, thank you for that insight. We appreciate it.